Hi everyone, it's Mrs Proctor here with another fun science experiment. So if you want to go and get some materials ready to take part, you need one piece of kitchen paper, some colouring pens, scissors and a bowl of water. So you can pause this video and come back to me when you're ready. Okay, let's begin. So here's my kitchen paper that I have cut and I'm going to show you what to do in a second. But I thought first, I've got to show you this, it's so exciting. I'm sure you can see two red dots on the front of mine. Look what happens when I put it into the bowl of water. Are you ready? Wow, you see a hidden picture come through. I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. So let me take that one out, ready for our next experiment. Okay, so if you've got all of your objects that you need, so one should be some kitchen paper. So you're going to fold it in half like this. Get yourself some scissors, children's scissors if you've got them. If not, ask an adult to help. You're going to cut this right through the middle. So you can have two goes at this, okay? So each part will open up. So it has a front and a part behind. This is one I did earlier. So what you're going to do is you're going to do your full picture on the back piece first. So here's mine, it's a little message for you with the rainbow. Now what you want to do is almost trace just a part of it without giving the whole thing away. So I've traced my rainbow, but you can't see my hidden message. That's the fun part. Okay, so now you have a try and we're going to watch this one go into the water. Ready? There's my rainbow. And there's my message. I miss you. I miss you all. Okay, so the reason why that works so well is tissue is very absorbent and the ink from felt tips so you're going to need some of these is absorbent too it absorbs in that paper and as soon as you put that into the water the water soaks in and your secret message is revealed so it's so fun i've tried this many times today so have a go at home remembering to start with your full message on the back and then close your tissue paper and just draw a part of it, so not to give your message away, okay? Or you could just draw a picture, or you could maybe send a nice video with a message to one of your loved ones or family or friends that you're missing right now. Have a go, let me know how you get on. Please send me pictures if you've got any, and keep looking on Tapestry for more of my videos as well. Bye for now.